Neche Experience, the only one-stop shop that focuses on an overall healthier you through our three pillars. Simply join our journey by ordering our 30-day workout plans, recipe books, skincare products, plus more. Remember to follow us on all social platforms and to stay up to date on what's new. Put action towards a better you. and I am back with another Neche Experience home organization video. Today we are going to cover shoes. Now in my previous video you can see the shoe racks that I've had before like everything else I've had them for way too long so I went ahead and ordered a new one on Amazon. It's a three-in-one five-tier shoe organizer. This is what it looks like. I'm gonna drop that link in the description. This is going for $69.99. So if you're someone who doesn't really like to put shoe organizers together, shoe racks together, you can easily do it yourself. The instructions are self-explanatory. I've already put it together. I just have to stack it and then we're gonna go organize the shoes. Now we're gonna still use the lifestyle organization chart. I'm going to redrop that right here. So let's go ahead and get started. So as you can see, I had a little mishap, of course, but, <laughs> but once you find the hole, it's really easy. But we're gonna go ahead and add the shoes, still following the lifestyle organization chart. So I have my old shoe rack here. Once we remove the shoes and add them where they need to go, we're going to break it down and get rid of it. Um, most of my shoes are already organized based off of that chart that I'm telling you about. So I've added the lifestyle organization chart to the very bottom of the screen. Remember, you're gonna follow that chart and go from your light colors to your dark colors. I'm gonna upload this to our social media platform so that you can use this at a later date. So if you have not, go ahead and follow us on Facebook and Instagram and theshayexperience.com. Now, if you look closely at the bottom, I did the bottom row a little different because these are the shoes that sit a little higher. So they're still gonna follow that chart. They're just not gonna be within the other sections as you can see. Now I'm gonna add the shoes that are in boxes to the side and then I will add my boots under that shelf. I really don't know what to call it, y'all. That is so crazy, but it's like that little shelf where you see I keep my purses the boots will go under there. If you want, you can opt to get pretty much more shelving space and you can stack them as you need. I just chose to get the one that I currently have, but you can always get more.
Okay, as you can see, it did not take me long at all. I still followed our chart. Went from light colors to dark colors, except for when I got to the very bottom. And that's because I had to improvise, mainly because these shoes are a lot taller than these here. So these are going from light to dark. And it's doing the same thing at the bottom row. It's just for these shoes that's a little taller. Here, these are my boots. And then I have shoes within a box along here. Let me turn it so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So the shoe boxes are along this section. And I went ahead and just so I can show you and get out of the way. These are the tubs from the previous video. So I have them lined up there. Hopefully you all found this video to be very helpful. And um, remember to let me know what videos you want to see. This is the main page of our website. Click that button at the top and go ahead and subscribe to our email, as well as scroll all the way down and choose the customer satisfaction survey. Fill that out and let us know what you want to see next and tell us about your experience with us, whether that's through workouts, recipes, skincare, or more.